Dave August Fulcher, hello and welcome to a brand new video. I hope you're all keeping well. Today we have a chill part for you. As you would have seen by the title, today's video is going to be a week in the life of Adam in isolation. But also, on top of that, for all you bacon lovers out there, we have got another baking video. Today I am accompanied by Sophia, who's down here getting stuff out of the press. And we're going to make some Malteser Millionaire Shortbread. Like I said, we have a two-parter. Part one is going to be a step-by-step -step on how to make these unreal Malteser Millionaire Shortbread. Part two, of course, is going to be the um, week in the life of me. We have to stay tuned for that. So keep watching all the way to the end so you can see what these look like. And also, what I got up to this weekend. Okay, so lads, first we're going to start with the ingredients, and I'll tell you what, we did all of this wrong. First up, we have these three packs of shortbread biscuits, followed by some butter, it should be unsalted, which we didn't have. After that, some sugar, we have some golden syrup here, a packet of Maltesers, some Malteser spread, which you couldn't buy, so we got dairy milk and added Maltesers to it, some cooking chocolate, and also some milk must be condensed, note that. Okay, so I'm going to be on camera duty today, so Phil is going to be baking these, because you're probably better off keeping the baking stuff to the person who can actually bake. All we have is a ninja blender. Um, we haven't got like an actual baking blender, so this is gonna have to do. Three, two, one. So I am currently melting the butter that we will be mixing in with the biscuit. So step number two is you get your blended shortbread and you mix it with the butter. Clearly it hasn't all blended. <laughs> oh my god, that's meant to be solid. Okay, so we've had a change of plan. That liquid stuff is gone. This is gonna be the top of it. It's an absolute disaster. What's your luck? We're rolling with it. We're still gonna try it. Probably not until tomorrow. Disaster. Sophia should be a waitress and definitely not a baker because it's actually her part that got messed up, but not mine. Anyway, go ahead. Even this is a disaster. Jesus. Last but not least is decor on our disaster. That just sums up the whole entire video. If it wasn't for all the liquidy parts on the side, right? This actually does not look too bad. But anyway, what you do, next step is, you put it in to the fridge, probably for the rest of your life, so you never have to look at it again. And um, yeah, you hope for the best, which we're not now hopeful for. Sophia clearly can't even get it in, so how could we be hopeful? Again, sums up the whole entire video. So, we know exactly why it ended up so badly. Um, it's because we use normal milk as opposed to condensed milk. So, um, yeah, that's the problem. If you're gonna attempt this at home, which I'm sure none of you are gonna try and do, because why would you? Um, use condensed milk, don't use normal milk. So, while we're waiting on that to um, do its thing, please enjoy the week of my life, starring Adam Kelly which hopefully won't be as much of a train wreck as that. Quickly before we do go to the week of my life, Hi, this is President Adam. I'm currently editing the video right now. I want to give a quick shout out to Jane Pastier. Is that how you pronounce the second name? I'm sorry, that's the person who came up with these ingredients. Just want to make sure I'm not copyrighted or anything. I didn't make this up. Uh, Jane Pastier, I'm going to put the link down in the description if you do want to also go and look and see how you make these. Hopefully not make as much of a disaster as us. It's only going to take 20 minutes. There was two of us, took us three hours. Don't know, we wish we were good at bacon. Anyway, link is down there. Enjoy the week of my life. Today's Monday, Monday the 20th, and we are going to work at the moment. I'm just about to get ready for work. It is currently 6.30 p.m. But look how bright it is outside though. <laughs> Hello, healthcare worker COVID-19 helpline, Adam speaking, how can I help? After a long and draining day, finally home, and I am knackered. You should go for a run after work on a Monday, but um, I'm just super tired today. I'm up since like six, so I'm gonna watch some post, not post, old show, 
DVDs because they're actually meant to be opening with Footloose tomorrow. Um, but thanks to COVID, that's not happening. Woo! This is like 45 minutes into the show now, um, and I still haven't entered. You're gonna see my first entrance now on stage, right? <gasps> ah, he's so handsome! Look at him! Look at these lights! This is so bad! <laughs> I got them all wrong! <laughs> what a loser! Look at everyone having so much fun! I'm playing this game with Sophia, which is essentially the app Granny. But. Oh. <laughs> Granny in the game is Peppa Pig. It is terrifying. So Piggy is currently chasing me. <laughs> it's such a scary game. It is so, so scary. Oh god, oh god, I'm gone. I'm gone, 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 I'm gone. Good morning. Happy Tuesday, everybody. We're gonna go for a 10k run. Maybe 12 and a half, we'll see. Lads, it's a sunny one today, but she's cold. It is a lot later now, it is half eight and um, should be on stage but we're not. Instead of at home, I'm doing this, look, I'm just after recording a video. Um, I've actually just recorded two videos. One of them is a Baldo a Music Society Experience one and one of them is a cover of my song from Full News. So um, yeah, I'm just editing the Baldo Experience one now. Four hours later. And I'm still editing. Defo, defo going to bed after this because I mean, it's late. Happy Wednesday, folks. <laughs> so, I'm no current doing the Instagram 5k challenge run thing. Um, it's my second time doing it today because the first time I had a mirror and it won't work. So yeah, I just finished it there. Um, 5km, 10km for me. I'll donate a tenner as well because I had 10. But Jane and Mac, I'm back. So I posted my YouTube video and um, it's going really well so far. Really, really good. Um, I've gotten a lot of feedback from a lot of people. Um, talking about how natural it is and how like um, I don't know real it is and it's just me showing my true personality which is really really great and um, so if you haven't seen it already check it out it was my previous video um, of my musical society it's fun it's just me talking about my experience in my musical society to date um, but yeah everyone seems to be really really enjoying it so thank you very very much it's really really great to get your feedback I really appreciate it anyway I think it's time to get some microwave popcorn and watch a film what do y'all think? Let me actually ask you all a question. Does anyone else make microwave popcorn and put chocolate in the popcorn afterwards and crisps? Or is that just me? So what I like to do is I like to get my microwave popcorn and um, like my buttered popcorn and put a, like a pack of cheese and onion crisps in there as well. And then maybe put like a pack of buttons in there too. Um, and it's just loads of different like textures. Like Ratatouille when his brother eats the two things at the same time. Just loads of different experiences. It's great. What do you want? Oh, he's going now. Yo, Benji! Benji! Unfortunately, we're out of cheese and crisps, which is what we're talking about. Popcorn. And mix your chocolate in there as well. Excellent, mate. Happy Thursday. Happy payday. I'm just wondering, what am I going to do today? Because I have no plans. Um... Yeah, I don't really want to go for another run because I did 10 yesterday when I only went to do 5. So yeah, I'm kind of stuck with what I'm going to do today. Just get out of the shower and look what we have here. A birthday box. The first ever unboxing. Eat a bag. What? What the? <laughs> You just got. I'm so confused. <laughs> Confirmed that wonderful gift is from one of my friends, Cullum. Yeah, thanks, Cullum. I love it. So I'm in Tesco Twitter. Um, it's the first time ever for me using my lanyard. I have to skip the queue. I hate to say lanyard, I kind of feel bad. 
like, should I be feeling bad for doing that? Or am I my right to do that? I don't know. But I'm gonna do that. Anyway. Sorry. Like I said, I'm already in Tesla. I'm doing a shop. So we've gotten so far. Shout out to Megan McInerney. Yeah, Megan, 379, your favorite drink. TGIF, huh? So I just got off a phone call there, which was a bit of a eye opener, I must say, um, where a woman told me that um, there was some issues in her workplace with PPE and um, with correct gear to wear for coronavirus. So I was like, yeah, grand, whatever, blah, 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 yep, to her about what she should do. And then she said the three of her friends committed suicide in the last couple of weeks because of depression during COVID. I just want to make it pretty clear that if anyone is feeling like that, if anyone's feeling down um, and alone, please send me a text or a comment on this or something and hit me up because nobody should feel alone. So keep doing it. It's better to speak and to stay quiet. There's nothing to be embarrassed about needing help. So please speak to a friend, me, anyone, family, speak to someone if you feel bad, if you have bad thoughts or anything. I'm on the FaceTime here to my uncle, but look at my burn! Look at that yoke! <laughs> Happy Saturday! So, I have just written a new song. Um, it's different to my other ones. You might know if some of my other ones is a bit, I mean, a bit sad. Or real. They are, that's what I'm going for. But anyway, this one's different. This one's a little bit happier. Um, I'm not going to sing it for you because the lyrics aren't done yet. Well, here it is anyway. Am I going to be the next Lewis Capadelli? Who knows? Anyway, I'm about to go and make a quiz now for a Zoom call I have with my friends, but I'm not going to record it because I want to actually just spend time with my friends who I haven't seen in a lot of long time. So yeah, catch us tomorrow. Happy Sunday, folks. I'm out for a 5k run at the moment. I'm going to make some clear to all of you at home. Um, a few people have been texting me recently about how I've been running outside two kilometers and not my twelve and a half kilometers or my five and a half kilometers or anything I do is within two which is it was within two kilometers of my house for them. Um, I just do laps. So you know not have to worry about texting me and telling me and telling me off and telling me that. And breaking laws and stuff. I hate you. So it's all good. And as you would have seen by the baking that was going on before this and after this, um, that's my Sunday. I started baking. I also um, had some Chinese. And today was a bit of a day. Pulled my hamstring. I tweaked a little bit on the run home. Early run. So today was a day. Not a great way to end the week, but alas, it's how we ended it. So, um,. Monday. This is um, the final product of our thing. We're putting it in the fridge overnight. <sighs> Even Benji isn't interested. And he is always interested in food. I'm gonna do a taste or anyway for you because I mean, might as well poise ourselves with the way the world's going.
I wouldn't recommend. Um, that's not too bad. To be honest with you, they're not too bad. They look very undercooked, but they are cooked. Not too bad. We we'll definitely use condensed milk. If you learned one thing from this, guys, use condensed milk. Sophia has just tried it. Sophia, what did you just say there? What's it taste like? Something from Costa. It tastes like something from Costa? It doesn't look like anything from Costa. Jane. <laughs> it's such a fail. It's put me in a bad mood. What a bad way to start the week. But anyway. Use condensed milk. Now, don't ever, ever, ever put something in my face again that I don't want in my face. Because then what happens is... Sophia! Because then what happens is... <laughs> bye bye baby, baby goodbye! Jimmy, that brings us a full cycle. Happy Monday everybody. I'm on my way to work again. Um, just like last Monday, back on my way to work again. And that's the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed our absolute disaster and the week in our life, um, leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And yeah, until then we'll see you next week. Thank you so much for watching guys. Goodbye.